Guys, this is very exciting news for home buyers out there, for any agents that have clients that may be having issues with their debt to income ratio. Freddie Mac recently announced the expansion of income eligibility for properties with an ADU. So what does this mean? What does it matter? How does it work? In the past, the income that was received in rent from an ADU was not considered qualifiable income, meaning a home buyer wanting to make a purchase with a property that had an ADU on site could not use that projected income as part of their qualifying income. So here's an example. Jerry and John wanna buy this house that has an ADU in the backyard. This ADU is projected to bring in about $2,000 a month. Jerry and John were not able to use that $2,000 as qualifying income for a home loan. So now Freddie Mac is saying that they recognize these rents and they are allowed to be used in your qualifying income. So to the home buyer that is out there wanting to increase their purchase power, uh, create passive income and build their long-term wealth, look at a property that has an ADU because now you can use these projected rents from that ADU as part of your qualifying income. So here's a few key uh, points that you want to remember. So number one, the property needs to be a single unit primary residence. Uh, number two, you need to have a lease agreement in place. Number three, the rents from the ADU cannot exceed 30% of your qualifying income. So meaning if Jerry and John make $2,000 a month and this ADU is going to bring in $2,000 a month, that won't work because the ADU income is 50% of the total uh, qualifying income that they're trying to use. So it's got to stay under 30%. Uh, the ADU must comply with zoning and land use requirements. There's a full appraisal required and landlord education required. So I think this is a super smart strategy for any home buyer out there interested in creating this passive income right from the start. So DM me if you have any questions about how this works or if you want more details. Hope you're having a great day. Take care.